Tyler Rake, played by Chris Hemsworth, was clinically dead after his last mission, but he got better. While recuperating, he learns that his ex-sister-in-law and her two kids need his help. Cue a heavily armored dash for safety with Kit Evans' dangerous brother-in-law is now on a tail. Welcome back to Movie This is the review of Extraction 2 and hear me talking about the positives and the negatives about the movie Extraction 2 and let's begin this review. When Extraction hit the streaming in April 2020, it came as a welcome action distraction in the pandemic landscape that was actually a blockbuster. This sequel arrives to a far more crowded feel but if anything it's more eye-catching and considerably bigger in scale. Director Sam Hargrave and star Chris Hemsworth have clearly pushed themselves to another level to go harder, to go higher and bloodier than ever. We open with a reminder that Chris Hemsworth's Tyler Rake, it's, it's still a ridiculous name to be honest who uh, basically died last time. Now, uh, slightly refreshingly, he does not immediately shrug it off, enduring months of rehab and a serious impairment for the first act of the movie. Then, of course, he's back to 100% in form in no time or by normal human standards, but 150%. I don't know. The, I, you know the plot armor, right? Now, the callback into the action movies is not by his usual BFF and manager Nick, but a via mysterious man played by Idris Elba, a messenger from his ex-wife. It now turns out that she needs him to rescue her sister from a Georgian prison where her powerful drug dealer husband David has been now keeping her and their kids is now close at hand. Okay, this is an interesting plot. Now, Rake will have to go and rescue the women and children and get them away from both David and his even more menacing brother Zurab. What could go wrong? Let's talk about it. Now, talking about Sam Hargrave, he is a stuntman turned director. He knows where to put his camera for maximum impact. Well, practically everything. From the moment that Rake is united with his ex-sister-in-law, the plan goes pear-shaped with a riot breaking out in the prison and the gateway complicated by Zorab's improbably well strike teams. Hargrave and Hemsworth have hyped up the film, but the relentless pace of the prison escape lives up to the hype as Rake takes on all the commerce and all and also, there's an integrated series of transport solutions to get the small family out of their uncle's fear of influence. Now, it's an assault of all senses, especially the ears and nerves, but it is also a satisfying merciless action thriller that manages to build on the scale and the ambition of the first. It's, I think, if the sequel is announced, I would be more happier, to be honest. But also talking about... Uh, but if I just tell as how Extraction 2 is, in short, I would tell is that it is as compelling as the character cuts through a personal strife whilst helping another family find the sense of freedom, but he too seeks a new trail that is blazed among the recenters. This series is bone crunching and it also has brutality and bravado. Okay, so would you rather watch on the Netflix or skip it? I would say it's hardly recommended for those action fans who have been waiting since John Wick chapter 4 to see the similar close to action like this but if you are going to forget what the actually storing is and if you are into gaping to the action this movie is for you and that's the review guys i would hope that you like share and subscribe and cheers